Agro Suede and welcome everyone to Agro Suede back to the garden with me, Mitchell Juno Suede. As the title says, we are going to make our own potting soil or planting soil. And basically what we're going to use is some potting mix, a lot of coconut pith and some organic soil material. Um, of course, I have already had this done, so I'm going to show you a video where I had it done basically with maybe some voiceover or music and then I'm going to show it to you right now which is like three weeks later. Okay guys, so this is our homemade potting soil or planting soil. Um, the bad news is that it rained quite a lot for the past two to three days and it seemed like it had a lot of water. As you can see here, it's very dark, so it had water in it. Um, so that one, I would really suggest that you have this place in a dry area. I do apologize, I did cover it with um, some plastics. However, um, I had to put in a few, a few watered plants so the water might have gone through when I had the plastic. So basically the plastic was here and I patted it to plant free watchet so that it could get some roots and look like water got in there. Um, yeah, it seemed like it is quite moist. Moist. Okay, not a lot of water. 
but I can smell it. I can smell it. it it's a bit funky because it, the water is in there. No? So let's just mix it up right now. Just see if we can get the moisture to spread evenly. So here we have it. We are now going to add this place into the trees. Let's go ahead. soil not a lot at all and some organic soil it really isn't too heavy as you can see it's holding a bit it do not look like it's very wet but watch the amount of water falling from it but you would never assume that it have that much in it okay once again watch this just by watching it if you hold it a lot of water isn't falling as you can see no water is really falling from it even having it upside down but by the moment you compress it See all that water is in there? So that is good. That means therefore I do not have to wet this often. And also that means it is able to retain moisture pretty well. So that is even better than the potting soil itself. Um, so I really want to encourage you, if you can, please have this idea experimented in your garden, your backyard garden, so that you could have your own potting soil or your own planting soil. And um, it's basically cheaper and more affordable. It's a lot more when you recycle this material than to buy the potting soil. So of course guys, remember, you can go ahead and try this out in your backyard garden. This is one of the best ways that you can get a lot of potting or planting soil um, for your plants. And please remember, as Agrosoil Backyard Garden always encourages, please try your best to start your backyard garden. If you do not have a lot of planting space, get a planting stand. Um, if you are living like in an apartment complex, make sure you get authority from the landlord and maybe start planting in like small pots. You can do like one pepper plant in a pot, um, some cucumber seedlings in a pot and try to build like a trellis. Eventually I will try all of those to show you how you can do it, especially when you're living in an apartment complex with no land to plant. Or you could have a neat garden or backyard or porch or veranda garden um, and a, at an apartment complex, of course, with authority from the landlord. So please remember that the backyard garden in some ways will keep the doctors away, it will keep poverty away, and it will keep hunger away. It will keep the doctors away by growing your own crops to have a healthier body, to be much healthier. It will keep hunger away by having food so that you could eat. And of course, it will keep poverty away so that you could actually grow your own food rather than spending money. Or you could plant enough to sell to make some side income or to make it your main income. Thank you so very much and Agris Wade is out.